Welcome back, kindergarten. So today, you're going to take your shark brace map and you are going to write an informative piece of text about amazing sharks. Today, I have a challenge for you. Not only are you going to use transition words, but today you're gonna to start your writing with a sentence that is going to grab your reader's attention. When I say that, it means I want you to think of something really cool to tell me about your shark or about what you learned about sharks. So not just saying first and then your fact about sharks. I want you to capture my attention. I liked yesterday's story on this page. It says, sharks are important to life in the ocean. I really, really, really like that fact. I want people to know that sharks aren't just scary, but they're really important to ocean life. So I'll start my sentence off, not with a transition word. This is an introduction sentence. So I will start it with an uppercase letter, sharks. are important and I'm going to put an exclamation point. I want my reader to know sharks are really important to the ocean. If they didn't exist, all sorts of bad things would happen. Now is when you get to use your transition words and now is when you get to use this brace map. All right. So decide what two, let's see, three or four facts you want to talk about today. So first, sharks can. Next, sharks have. Then, sharks are. And either finally or last, your last little um, fact. So after my introduction sentence, that's sentence one, then I'll write the word first. And then I'll come over here to my brace map. What do I want to say first? Hmm. I think my reader should know right away that sharks are fish, not mammals. Very interesting, I think. So I'm going to say sharks first, sharks. are fish. Next. So after my first sentence, I ended my idea and then I have a finger space. All of my little letters are way below this dotted line and then my tall letters stop at the top my letters that fall below, like my P, it's okay that they come down this far. They're supposed to. They're falling letters. Okay, after your next sentence, then you'll write, then. And after your then sentence, you'll write, finally or last. And tell me your final idea. So this week, kindergarten, you have your introduction sentence, you have your first, next, then, and last sentence. So this week, you will make sure you have five sentences. You can do it. You've been practicing so much. Um, when you're finished with your writing, you can um, draw up here, you can draw a picture of a shark and if you'd like to label it, you may, or you can just draw um, whatever kind of picture you'd like. I will be video recording a direct -to draw of a shark this week. So if you'd like to watch that when you draw, go ahead. Have so much fun. I love and miss you guys so much.